not even think it's him because it can't be him because he's talking to you while it's happening. You actually got, you got absolutely boned, sir. Man, y'all are perfect like, criminal. Yeah, you guys got absolutely boned. Holy shit, you guys are so smart. Hmm. Interesting. Well, I don't believe it was Jason Pullum. Why not? Like I said, I, because, uh, well, it doesn't match his physique. That's my his boy, bro. That's my boy. And on top of it, you know, uh, as far as uh, Jason Pullum, like I said, he's got an alibi, right? So, he's good. Well, he's got an alibi. I mean, an a you know, it's this, like a, it's this like a horseshoe type fucking deal, right? Something can be so good, it's really bad. Sometimes the best alibi is the opposite. It's not an alibi at all. It's actually just right. him doing Sometimes it. You can have a perfect alibi. Be suspicious. But it's just it's just bad because it's so good it's bad. It goes around. Right. And I, and I totally get what you're saying. So I think he got you. I think I think he's making fun of you. Okay. Well, listen. Okay. I can't wait for that day till well, everything you've told me as far as Jason Pullum, his criminal activity, his criminal enterprise, what he's trying to do. Right. He'll be uh, taken down, right? His deal will yeah, come. Take, no, he won't. Not tomorrow. Because tomorrow if they get control of the guns tomorrow. Okay. Uh, what do you know about them? Uh, I just know that tomorrow the bi a big thing is happening tomorrow, and apparently Jason Pullman is getting a bunch of guns. So I'm just letting you know right now. True. Okay. And where's this coming from? Coming from the uh, the underground. The underground. The sewers? Nah. From the from the online chatter. Mm. Okay. <laughs> and um, what do you know about this underground? Yeah, well, bro, I, I I can't bear here. Hold on. Yeah, yeah, you have to. Uh, Oh, okay. What do you know about the underground? What do you know about that a little bit? You know? I, just, I just read. I just read online, bro. I read online and then the dark market forums. I read. And you believe everything you see online? What hell was happens? Most okay. criminals that know what they're doing, I mean, I've heard, um, have access to the uh, the underground the chatters, and um, it happens. How can one enter this uh, underground? You can't. Not you. You gotta be invited. Yeah, you need a signed dongle. Yeah, he, uh... He's spoken to me about this before. Uh, yes. You need a signed dongle. Well, oh, you, you, you took the words out of my mouth. Dongle. USB dongle, in fact. Mr. Paul, what do you know about those? What do you mean those? There's only one. There's only the signed one. Well, I mean, um... There's some folks who've been freaking out over them recently. And I'm trying to understand why. It's just a USB drive, you know, a dongle. Oh, Why there's no, I, didn't, out? I heard about some other USBs. Different colors or whatever. These are all knockoffs so from China. They, they suck. Yeah, why are people fight, fighting tooth and nail for something like that, right? It's just a, it's just a drive. Because they want right? access to the underground market, but they, they, they're not finding the sign one. All they're getting is replicas from China because they're taking our jobs. Really? Yep. It, it goes that deep. It does, yeah. And who runs this? Who, who's behind this? I mean, what kind of influence? What kind of power? Who, who names? I mean, this is really deep. It's Maple. Okay. Maple. It's actually okay. Talk to you. All right, sure. Oh, what wow. He just so happened to walk by. I just say, see that? Look at that. Look. Uh, what a coincidence. Hey, Mr. Paul, come what on. a coincidence. Yeah, I mean, right. Well, come on, Mr. Paul. See, now he's gone. See, look at that. Now he's gone. Yeah. Okay. Yep, that's it. That's it. He's going he's gonna to see his information, and now it's done. So what's uh what's transpiring tomorrow? What's so big that's happening tomorrow? Jason Pullam, okay, um, with his squad, um, Janius Baloney, Janius Baloney, yes, and then Joy Pepperoni, yes. Okay, be be serious, Mister Paul. What what's going on tomorrow? I mean, it, <clears throat> Bologna, Joey Pepperoni, no, Pepperoni. Janius, I mean, John. I, you can look into the report. Huh? Go to the point and go uh -huh. search Janius Baloney. It's a real person. Okay. okay. So. Okay. Janius Baloney. Ah. Uh -huh. Joey Pepperoni. Yes. Okay. <laughs> Jason Pullam. Yes. Okay, that's three. Um, there's one more. There's one more. Chat, who's pastrami? There's one more. There's one okay. more. I can't remember the last guy. All right. So, so what are these people doing tomorrow? They're getting guns. Getting guns from where? Could be anywhere, really. Usually at the docks, though. That's what I heard, anyway. It's what he says. It. I got you. Okay. I told, I, so you. I told that in my first report with you guys. I literally, I literally told you that they get them at the docks, or at least that's what he said, right? And that's what I saw too. 
I saw him pick it up over there. I saw it. I got you. And and where did you get this information again? I got I got it direct. I got it direct. I saw it. You you saw. So what 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 exactly did you see, Mr. Paul? I saw um, Jazon Polam um, go into a box and get a bunch of guns. Okay. And what would him going into box to grab a bunch of guns lead you to believe? that there would be a further gun robbery the next day. Yeah, and there was. And I told you about it, but you guys didn't do anything about it. And then, um, you know, you guys asked why I got the gun that I had way before. That's why I got it. Jason. Yeah, no, I understand that. I, I'm, I'm, I'm more asking about tomorrow and what the information... Tomorrow, tomorrow you, you we get eight cases, so it is what it is. Tomorrow, say again? Tomorrow, tomorrow, the, the, the world of the undermarket, the, uh, the, the dark market... We're getting AKs, bro. It's on the block. Tomorrow you'll be getting AKs. Jason from is getting AKs tomorrow, yes. And it's from the crates down the docks. Yeah. All right, what makes you believe that it's going to be AKs and not just, you know, pistols, whatnot, etc.? Because it's it, it's on the it's on the online chatter. You can literally, you can literally see what you're getting. You're getting AKs. Mr. Paul, uh, if this does not happen tomorrow, should I call you a liar? Oh, yeah, yeah, absolutely, yeah. But if I'm right, though, what do I get? Because I'm giving you valuable information. Honesty. To tomorrow, mm -hmm. we, you will be getting multiple um, robberies or um, ammunition crates are going are gonna to be gone. Multiple AKs. Okay. I'm going to so, take this information very seriously. So, so what do I get tomorrow when it happens? Um, if what you say is true, I'll come to you with, with five, ten grand. Okay, roughly around that. If what you say is true and that information provided for us as far as AK 47s okay. and those crates, provide with 510 grand because those well, I mean, guns. If they get scammed, right? Well, not my fault. But they, they, there will be. There will be tomorrow. In 18 hours, there will be. 18 I hours mean, exactly? Uh, yeah, unless you have a pad. You want to give me you wanna give my pad back? I can probably check. Ah, I'm just okay, kidding. So you know the exact time that all this is going down. Yeah, you're very well connected, Mr. Paul. Yeah. So hmm. when it happens tomorrow, you give me a call, man. Maybe hmm. maybe you could step in front of uh, Mr. Mr. Polam's house and wait till he fucking goes on with all the fucking the kids. Yeah, I really hope when I re unreveal the mask, it's gonna be a Jason Pullum, not a Gene Paul. Hmm. Why would it be me? I don't know. I'm just saying. I'm just saying that what you're saying is completely true. I'm taking it with the utmost seriousness, and that for that information you provide today, we will drop that charge that we mentioned. Right. Wait, wait, we'll wait. Go with wait. What? Why the heck would it be me? I wouldn't tell about my plan. I'm doing tomorrow. Because you know about this information, right? What if you had a change of heart and say, you know what? Maybe I want a piece of the pie. Uh, no, nah, I'm good on that. Well, Mr. Paul, you have in our in our last interrogation, you did say that you did get paid for by receiving one of the guns. So what will change this time? Well, I'm what? Wait, you can't. What you're saying right now, right, is that you cannot make the distinction between a, a um a trafficker and a customer. I'm just, I just got a gun. I'm going to tell you. I'm, right. just, I'm, just, a, I'm just a mere Are customer. You a customer for life or a one-time customer? I don't know. Okay. What is he looking at right now, Suarez, as far as charges? Uh, I've dropped the Joe Ryan and he is facing felony obstruction and reckless evading. Oh, okay. God. And how long has he been, time, how long he's been in, in, in uh... Oh, no, it's all good. It's all good. You can leave me, you can, you can leave me to rot in there, bro. I'm, I got to do uh, my heist. Speaking of leaving a rot, uh, I'm still here. There's no one... Nice. Yeah, they're, yeah, they're but working the charge right now. My, they're, they're, uh, is the um, we're, we're aware. I got to do the heist anyway, so I'll be there. I'll be there for years. I forgot. Go for God. Sure? Right. Maybe we should give you time, sir. No, don't make it. Hard. I got to do the heist. Oh, that's a good. That's a good point. Maybe, uh, no, 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 maybe the jail has, has to wait for another day. You want the forty-nine months? I respect that. You know, you're gonna do the time setting your business. Full time. Them, give me, give me all of it. I can um, take it. Uh, Captain, you'll need to bill him and send him in. Uh, can you just move me over to that quiet room right there? I'm. I cannot. I cannot. Oh, I see. I can't. See my my. No, you're fine. All right, Mr. Paul. What's up? You're looking at 